Did he catch you with the... No. I ate all the evidence before I could find it. Ah, Adam Mule. I think I'm gonna go lie down. I'm feeling a little sweaty. wonder if it's connected to all those cans of trans fat I ate. And there's a shooting pain in my left arm. And my chest hurts. That's so weird. Oh! Oh, Dad! I think I'm having a heart attack! Steve, we gotta get you to the hospital! No! Don't do it! Turlington's onto us! We'll be found out and... Oh, shamed in the paper. <gasps> but it's not too late. We can kill Turlington. Or firebomb the newspaper. Or both. Steve, uh, we can't. Why? Because it's illegal to kill a cop who's up in your business? But but that's a stupid law. And it's okay to break those, right, Dad? <laughs> what have I done? I've turned my own son into an amoral smuggler who believes you can pick and choose which laws you follow. Oh, 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 oh. Dad! This is it. Steve, no! Don't go to the light! Go as close to the light as you can, and then ask my grandfather why Jim Neighbors was at his funeral. But then come back! Steve, can you hear me? Local crime beat be damned, I'm taking you to the hospital. Unless, of course, this kick revives you. Uh. Dad? He's waking up! What happened? Son, you're okay. Turns out you didn't have a heart attack after all. Which, in my opinion, makes all your dramatics on the kitchen floor a bit uncalled for, but whatever, you thought what you thought. You have angina, which, according to Dr. Natterson, sounds like vagina. I, I don't know about that, but he's the doctor. Dad, you... you brought me to the hospital? Of course I did, son. Having you safe and sound is all that matters. But that means your picture's gonna be in the paper tomorrow. It was in the paper six weeks ago. You've been in a medically induced coma. I was shamed, I suffered, and I've moved on. And frankly, the family's recently been far more concerned with Roger's runaway banana boat. It's been quite a story. A little big, but funny. 